Hello, welcome back to the Olden Shot. Today we're looking at uh, photographs taken with the Minolta XGM through the standard Minolta MD50 1.7 lens and with what might be a new favourite film, Former Pan 100. We went out to a place called Belsay Hall and Castle. It's an estate just northwest of Newcastle, once owned by the Middleton family, rich landowners. Started off as a peel tower, um, which was the castle part. Then the family built on a great hall and other li living accommodation became Belsay Castle. And then maybe 200 years ago um, they had a hall built, um, more of a stately home, moved everything out of the castle into the hall and the castle um, became sort of semi-derelict or a folly even. Anyway it's a lovely place to visit if you're in the area, Belsay Hall and Castle and Gardens, lovely place to visit. I developed the former pan with Ilfatech LC29 and um, as soon as I hung the film up to dry I could tell that I had uh, punchy negatives. Um, and when I eventually scanned them I was really happy with the results I got from this film. It's um, Low grain and nice grain. Um, medium contrast I would say and uh, quite sharp. Nice film and it's cheap. About the cheapest film you can get. The camera, as you can see I've got my Coking A series filter holder and all the sunny shots where you can see the sky were taken with the yellow filter and I think the yellow filter on this film worked very well compared to the orange filter on the last video. Um, the orange filter was nice but the yellow filter was definitely something special. So we're going to have a look at the photographs and um, then I'll come back to you. See what you think of these. So there we go, um, those photographs, um, Belsley Hall um, only appears in one photograph and that's the one with the scaffolding. They're replacing the roof at the minute and with all the scaffolding on it looks like a massive game of Kerplunk. The, um, the filter was used in any shot where you can see clouds and sunlight. Um, in the gardens, under the trees, it was a bit dark and the uh, former Pan 100 isn't a very quick film. I used it at box speed and there just wasn't the margins to use the yellow filter on. But just to reiterate, that film really is good and um, the results I'm very happy with. 
I've still got to use the red filter yet and um, I don't know if that's my next video or I might be using um, a Canon autofocus camera with a big zoom um, up to 300 millimeters big zoom um, that decision would be made made um, within the next day or two um, for the moment um, that's what we got with the XGM and uh, former Pan 100 thank you for watching um, as you can see the cat hasn't moved much since the last video it's terrible when your cats suffer from seasonal adjustment disorder but it just doesn't want to go out in this weather isn't that right so are you going to speak hello hello that's it from me and Ziggy socks is upstairs on the bed and we'll see you again soon. Bye for now.